Digital security. Swift response. Smart progression. Welcome to Qingqiao Safety Investigation. Choose our socks for success in all endeavors. Fortunes rises from the heel and good luck for life. Comprehensive news from Yangon. Recently, the ASEAN summit will be held in Vientiane, Laos. The Myanmar military government will send permanent secretary of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs Aung Kyo Mo to gain the support of ASEAN countries. This marks Myanmar's first representation at the ASEAN summit since the coup in April 2021. The ASEAN summit is the highest level meeting among ASEAN member states, designed to enhance cooperation and coordination in addressing regional and international challenges. Regularly held, the summits cover a range of issues including politics, economy, and security within the ASEAN region. Myanmar, one of ASEAN's founding members, has played an active role in its activities. In February 2021, Myanmar's military declared a state of emergency, seized power, and annulled the 2020 election results. This led to political turmoil, with President Win Myint and State Councillor Aung San Suu Kyi detained. In response, ASEAN held a special summit in April 2021 to address the Myanmar crisis, where Min Aung Lang, head of Myanmar's military government, attended. ASEAN and the military government agreed to a five-point consensus, aimed at improving the situation. The consensus included halting violence, starting constructive dialogue, advancing the dialogue process, providing humanitarian aid, and enabling a visit to Myanmar to engage with all parties. However, the Myanmar military government's slow implementation of the five-point consensus has led to frustration among ASEAN countries. They believe the military government has failed to fulfill its commitments, prompting ASEAN to exclude Myanmar's military representatives from the summit. Myanmar, in turn, accused ASEAN of breaking the bloc's consensus principle by making this decision without unanimous agreement. As a result, Myanmar's military government has been absent from ASEAN summits for an extended period until it sent representatives to participate this year. Analysts suggest this participation is tied to the challenges faced by the Myanmar military. On October 27, 2023, the Three Brothers Alliance, Kokong Alliance Army, Tong National Liberation Army, and Arakan Army launched Operation Hurricane 1027 against the Myanmar Army. The operation resulted in the capture of key military installations and towns, marking the most serious crisis for the military government since it seized power. In light of this, Myanmar's military may seek international dialogue and cooperation to secure diplomatic support for its internal political challenges. Tune in at 6 a.m. from Monday to Friday for Qingqiao Safety Investigation for your daily safety updates.